I know, I know. 95% of the time, you have to ask for the digits. But Kira's gonna tell you how to get a girl to volunteer for digits. Well, to give or get digits, I think that the guy should court the girl, and it kind of is the guy's job to make initiative. But because it's 2010, and if a girl truly does, you know, like a guy, and I actually did this recently, I gave the guy my digit. I don't think there's anything wrong with that. I have actually left my phone number on a napkin for a waiter that I thought was really, really cute. He never called. <laughs> I have left my digits on the back of a random business card and gave it to somebody who was somewhat high profile. We wound up dating for a couple months and it took a lot of guts to just write down my number and say, hey, you know what, if he calls, great. If not, screw it, whatever. As girls get insecure too. I once wrote my digits on a guy's cast in lipstick. <laughs> he never called, so I'm hoping it's because it washed off. I have given a guy my digits at the beach. Yes, that's a pretty casual place and a good place to meet people. We were playing football. And one of the other guys that I didn't know that we started playing with at the end of the game was like, hey, we should go out and get dinner. And that's perfect. It's not, oh, let's go get wasted in a bar. Hey, come over and hang out at my place at 11.30 at night. Be creative. If a guy's creative, that's definitely gonna get you the digits. I would probably give my digits immediately to Kellen Lutz. He's in those Twilight movies. Yum. Jacoby Ellsbury, he plays for Boston Red Sox. But they both have girlfriends, so I'm out of luck. Don't forget to sub.